tell me your favorite Jalen Hurts story that can be, uh, you know, I guess definitive in telling fans who he is and what he means for your team. You got a great Jalen Hurts story for me, Hassan Reddick? Oh, man. When I first signed, you know, I had played against the Eagles twice before coming to, uh, you know, matter of fact, I played against Jalen when mm-hmm. he when he came to the Eagles. I played against Jalen twice before coming to Philadelphia Eagles myself. Mm-hmm. And you know, we we we've had some battles. You know, I I was able to get him once or or twice as far as sacking him, but even winning, I I I was able to beat him once, and he beat me once when I was with Carolina. Mm-hmm. And I remember when I got signed here, he was the first one. You know, text me, hey man. I am glad you are here. And I'm like, I'm glad to be here. He's like, no, listen, I'm tired of you chasing me around <laughs> on the field. I'm glad now that you are here and I no longer have to worry about you. So, you know, just extremely humble, uh, a, a great human being, Rich. And, you know, that's my story. That's my Jay Hurt story. Well, I mean, he's uh, just the fact that he has the screensaver on his phone. Have you seen it, the screensaver on his phone, Hassan? Have you seen that? Yes, I have. What did you think of no, when you saw what the photograph is of him coming off the field, uh, you know, dejected after you guys uh, were unable to complete the mission in the Super Bowl? Yeah, he, he has a chip on his shoulder, Rich, and he's been working extremely hard. Um, you know, he, he he took accountability for the game, which I felt like he shouldn't have done. You know, he put it on himself for what happened in the Super Bowl. Um, and he wants to get back, and he wants to win. He wants to win one for the city. He wants to win one for the team. Uh, the, 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 the man's a winner, Rich. He's a winner, and that's what he wants to do, and he knows what that means. That means winning the big one. Let's be honest here. Let's talk honestly before I send you on into your day, Hassan Reddick. I need an honest answer here, and I don't need the just everything, every game matters the same. Which one are you circling the most on the Philadelphia Eagles? If I'm being honest, I have two games. Scheduled. Please, please, be honest. We're, there's two circles. What are the two circles on for the Philadelphia Eagles schedule, Hassan? Uh, definitely Kansas City mm-hmm. um, after, you know, going to the Super Bowl and uh, losing it. Um, so definitely Kansas City. Mm-hmm. And then uh, that San Fran game. Um, man, a lot of a lot of chirping, a lot of back and <laughs> forth over social media. Uh, about what have, could have, and should have happened. Um, you know, so I'm, I'm looking forward to that one. No no game uh, more than that one. Yeah, I was about to say, I mean, you did win that one. And part of the reason mm-hmm. why you won it is you got home, right? And mm-hmm. you, did, you did get to the quarterback. You personally did get to the quarterback, yeah. right? So how did you take that chirping, clearly? Uh, man, you know, I, I I never weighed in on it. Um, for me, I I, I watched. I I seen things that guys were saying. Debo, Samuel, uh, Fred, a lot of these guys that came out and talked about it. You know, and I re- I respect them, right? I respect them for what I respect them for their opinion and their thought and their belief in their team. Um, for me, man, I, I'm the same way. I believe in my team. I believe in my teammates. And I feel the same way. So for me, it's like, bring it on. You know, y'all y'all, y'all kept on talking. Y'all talked about this all offseason, through the Super Bowl, after the playoff game. So it's like, better be prepared, man. Because, uh, you know, I know I will be. And, uh, and I know that I'm going to do my best to make sure the team is ready, too. Yeah, that is week 13. So bring a lunch pail, is what you're saying, to yeah, that yeah. game. Yes, sir. All right, Hassan Reddick. I will look forward to that one, and I have circled this interview and say let's do this again. Thanks for the call. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern for free.